You gave up, Minerva. I never will. Tell her. Get him. Stab her. Oh, okay. We good. Okay, we good. Stop this. Previously on The Walking Dead. While searching for a place to call home, AJ and I found an old boarding school run by kids deep in the forest. Their leader was a guy named Marlin. And AJ pulled the trigger. I told AJ that what he'd done was murder, that he'd have to atone for it. The other kids agreed. Uh -huh. They voted to kick us out. They I violated. Thought we'd never return. Then, AJ and I were attacked by Abel, one of the raiders Marlin had given the twins to. He was with someone I thought I'd never see again. Lily came out the Lily. cut like ear. We were almost eaten by walkers when suddenly one of them spoke to me. His name was James, an ex whisperer who didn't believe in killing walkers. He helped me treat AJ, but without real medicine, he wouldn't make it. The kids didn't turn away the sad sight of AJ and let us back inside. After I told them how we could defend the school against the raiders, they were willing to let us stay, at least until the fight. I decided to help Violet in the bell tower. We looked at the stars together. She and wanted I love, I had like, feelings for her. and I was chilling. She felt the same way. She wanted to kiss. When the raiders finally came, they busted open our gates, but the kids stayed hidden as planned. Until Ten ran out of cover hoping for a chance to learn about his missing sisters. The bomb went off, and attempting to save Ten, Mitch threw himself at Lily and got a knife to the throat. With only a second to decide, I fired and saved Violet. They got away with three of our friends, and we had no idea where they'd gone. But we knew someone who did. Dun, dun, dun. Waited like an extra four months for this. Companies want to shut down and become other companies to continue on. Look at those decorations. They did work though. Just dying in this. Like, this is a Game of Thrones. Like, jabbed in the eye by some asshole who never even knew his name. Mitch was looking after all of us. He gave his life so we could go on fighting. I know that. Doesn't make it any easier. Right. He'd want us to find our friends and bring them home safe. And he'd want us to kill the people who took them. Hey, I don't know about all oh, that, but we got Abel tied up ten take it as you he's will, son. He's out cold. Thanks. We should bury Mitch. It's time. Look, if anyone needs some backstory, just let me know. I got you. Oh, snap. We had a plan, and that idiot messed it up! 
Come on, Willie. None of this is Ten's fault. You know who's really to blame. I can't believe you're defending him. This... This is bullshit. Ten. I'll take care of this. Talk to Abel. Find out where Lily took Lewis. Yo, know, who's these sick. three people in the chat? Let Abel? me know, please. Don't be I'm lonely in here. You know, hurt him a little. Maybe you'll get more out of him than we did. Hurt him a little. Everyone is mad and violent. I mean, I don't know why, but... Time to go medieval times on this dude. That dog, I can't stand it. No, there's nothing wrong with the dog. I don't need to get yelled at. Why is there blood here? What have you been doing? Or just like that? I got a trophy though. Brody. How y'all leave? Y'all want to bury bodies, but y'all don't want to clean up blood. Like, got your gun back, huh? Uh huh. AJ ain't playing. He never been playing. He been about that action. Ready. Classic. <coughs> Fuck. Well, it ain't no way to wake an old man up from his afternoon nap. I was having a nice dream too about a girl I used to know from before. She also had me tied up, but I wasn't a prisoner if you get my meaning. <laughs> Did you have your arm? <laughs> That's what I want to know. You got any water? Other than what you already dumped on me. I mean, drink. You got good manners, Squirt. Don't mind if I do. <laughs> no, I is thirsty. I mean, you man's is water. thirsty. Now it's time to talk. This is the first time interrogating someone, isn't it? You let me dictate the agenda. Makes me think you're weak. Don't make this harder than it needs to be, okay? I just want to know where Lily took my people. It doesn't matter. As soon as she gets there, she's going to turn around and come right back for me. <laughs> you better give me the five-star treatment. I don't like I'm this dude already. Here, you might be able to trade me for a little mercy. This is what they we usually say. You little shits. Lily won't make the same mistake twice. You think Lily would come back for you? Look at the state you're in. You're worthless to her now. I can heal. There is no rescue party, Abel. Only a bunch of pissed off kids who want you dead. So tell us where our friends are. You trade it for mercy. Oh. <laughs> Lily will never give him up. The only reason we came here was for more manpower. Losing Jonathan and me, three sprouts can barely hold a gun. Even a dummy like me can do the math on that one. We're gonna get him back. You don't know what it's like out there. It's a bloodbath. One community against another. From Richmond to the coast, back at the Delta, we're at war. With some really sick fucks who make me look like the Virgin Mary. We need people to fight it. Soldiers who do what we say, point the guns the way we tell them to. You little turds are supposed to be easy pickings. That's called kidnapping. Give it whatever name you want. I call it survival. What kind of place is this Delta if they use forced labor to defend it? 
You think we like doing raids like this? Our home is under threat. It's a good home. Built to last. Uh -huh. We do a lot to protect it. Maybe you can understand now. Like, I'd be thinking they're talking crazy, but like... So stop wasting my time. Maybe they really do need help. And they're not even letting us, like, check okay. out the real situation. Front pocket. The answer to all your questions. Like, I'm trying to find out what's really going on here. Whatsoever parteth the hoof and is cloven-footed, and cheweth the cud among the beasts that shall ye eat, what the fuck? Is this code? No, it's fucking Leviticus. I was hoping it'd be some timely moralistic shit about turning the other cheek. Well, come on. That thing ain't gonna light itself. I don't know where your friends are. Smoke will clear my mind. Is he serious right now? Help me remember stuff. Like where Lily went. Come on, kid. Don't make me wait all day. Oh, yeah, a while. Him. <clears throat> Oops. Bitch. You wanted? I did, but yeah. you're gonna get your wish. When you pushed me off that balcony, something must have burst inside of me. I never want things to end like this. Everything. It all got out of hand. Now look at me. I'm a fucking mess. Will he turn? No. <clears throat> my, my whole life. Why, he, why is he out there scared got, now? I got with my own two hands. And my will. For my body. To turn on me. To take control. I'll tell you where to find Lily. Just promise, you won't let me turn. I'm begging you. Where is all you got? The Walking Dead television show. If you're honest with me, I'll put you out of your misery. You have my word. Okay, we have a boat. We're docked a few miles west of here. At an old fishing pier. Your friends are on the boat. You, you got what you wanted. Please, don't let me become one of those things. Please, I don't want to turn. Fine, damn. Not that. Let me keep my face. You don't need to watch this. I wasn't need. I want to. Okay, yeah. I mean, you know, it said need, and then it said want. Like, I right, got goodbye. <laughs> At least you can't hurt anyone anymore. Yeah. Come on, we have a boat to find. 
Look at him taking in information. Guess we're going to the boat. I'm gonna sneak some food while this happens. And I get this copyright strike. That wasn't very long. <clears throat> we out on the road already? Once we find the boat, we'll look for a way to sneak on board. Yeah, if Ten doesn't fuck it up this time. Yo, chill. He's not another Ben. Yes, it was. Mitch died because he... Say one more thing about Tim. Ooh. Guys, look. Chill, Savage. We're getting right into the action. Scott Bell ain't playing games. Can't even say Telltale no more. You see anything? The he piece, just looked. Um, a boat and a, a wood street in the water. That's called a pier. Hmm. Pier. Okay. Let's spread out and focus on those areas. Keep your heads low. Why is my chest so quiet? Got like three people in here. Anything useful? Looks like building material. Furniture. Probably stuff from the train station. those rafts with supplies. I could cut those loose and just ride them down river. Easy. I'm not going to burn it. We could take those. Sheet metal, wood, and quite a bit of it. We should have that stuff. Huh. Are those torches? Maybe. Why? We could use the fire. I just want a friendly conversation. Now we had talking about fire. You ever seen this boat before? No. Marlin kept us confined to the safe zone. Pier leading up to the boat? It's our only way in and out. Well, let's see what else is down there. Dang, they got people on guard. Yeah, on deck. A couple others on the pier. <clears throat> Could be more inside. Looks like they're well armed too. Wait, I see Lewis. Abel wasn't lying. This is it. I can see an entrance. I saw that too. It looks like there's a door at the other end. There's a small opening at the top of those closed doorways. AJ and I know how to deal with those. Well, we know how to deal with doors. AJ sauced. I don't see any obvious place to keep. Lily really might be up there. They're probably below deck. We should have asked Abel. When he said on a boat, 
I didn't think it'd be this big. Same. The pier has plenty of cover on it. If we're careful, we can sneak in undetected. Okay, well, all these people? There's no good cover leading up to the boat. We're gonna need one hell of a distraction. Water! One word, and then we're all Maybe done. Maybe if we could get walkers on the beach somehow. Maybe not as hard as you'd think. You ran all the way back here to continue this. I'm done with you. Who was the last person? Why are you hiding? Find anything over here? They have horses. Let me see. Horses? More torches. Setting the hay on fire would get their attention. Scare the horses too. We could get on the boat easier that way. Sounds like it's the easiest plan so far. If we cut those horses free, we could slow down anyone trying to chase us. We should get out of here before they spot us. We can talk through the plan once we're somewhere safe. They've got guards posted on the pier and the boat. There's no way we can take them all at once. Our only hope is to distract them while we sneak on board. We should burn their stuff. That'd work. We could burn the supplies or the hay they keep for the horses. Whatever we don't burn, we should take. Ruby would love to have the horses. But I'd rather steal those supplies. I could build traps. We don't need no horses. Weapons. Yeah, we'll steal their supplies and burn the hay as our distraction. If you're going to steal from the rafts, you have to do it carefully. Wouldn't do it any other way. The fire will lure the raiders away from the boat, and we can sneak across the pier. If anyone sees us, they'll shoot! You remember that guy I told you about? James? He sent in walkers to save us from Lily and Abel. Maybe we could convince him to do it again. If we lead a big enough group of them onto the beach, we can blend in without being seen. Perfect. What about after we get everyone home? I mean, the raiders will just come attack us again. What then? Well, that makes sense. Hide, quick! Is that a lily? All alone? A raider. Has to be. You all stay here. I'll see if they know anything that could help us. you steal I don't know what you're I'm not fucking around answer the question the boiler deck second deck they're all there Clementine wait that it's Minnie I wasn't sure. I mean, 
I heard they burned half your school down. Who survived? Ruby? Mitch? Brody? Ten? Ruby and Ten made it. Mitch did. And Brody, um, she died. Ten's boots holding up okay? His boots? They're <laughs> so old, they're more holes than rubber. I duct taped him up the last time I saw him, but that was a while ago. His boots are fine. You're Clementine. The girl who took over after Marlin died. It's weird. I thought everyone would want to lean on their own. I didn't ask to be put in charge. It just sort of happened. Is that the kind of wishy-washy bullshit you see to everyone back home or just... <laughs> Excuse me? Abel figured he could talk Marlin into handing everyone over like he and Lily did... Like they did before. You ruined the whole plan. That's not a good plan. And he gave you and Sophie away. Yeah, and we all survived it. Marlin would have never made them fight the way you did. He wouldn't have gotten people killed. Many are wrong. Glenn protected us. Yeah. And how come so many people are dead? You know, Minnie, you sound an awful lot like one of them. That's really close to the speech Lily gave me in the woods. It's the truth. Where's Sophie? Is she alive? She... She died protecting the Delta. Wow. A hero. A hero? God, you know that! Shit. Rockingham! Finish up and head back. I want to be in before dark. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> Our boat leaves for the Delta in two days. Then it'll be a couple of weeks before we can come back for the rest of you. When we do, don't fight. The only way you're going to save your people is to let us take them. I'm serious. Don't fight this. It's not too late, Minnie. You could come back to the school with us. No. No, I couldn't. Wow. She's been converted. She's a Sith. Are you okay? Nothing's changed. Our plan is to get onto the boat and save our friends. So that's what we're gonna do. You all should head home. Start getting things ready. Get everyone caught up on the plan. Everyone except ten. I warned you. Enough. Both <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yo, he's... <laughs> Yo, AJ ain't playing no more games. <laughs> so, how many walkers do you think James will help us get? Fifteen? A hundred? A thousand? Clem, I don't... Uh, oh, I, don't do no Spider-Man. It feels like someone pinched me from inside. Here, let's rest a second. No, he better not pull a Spider-Man on me. Clem... I keep thinking. When Bully said all that stuff about Tin before, I got so mad. He was being mean. Tin wasn't even there to defend himself. I wanted to hurt him. 
I know I shouldn't, but I just can't stop thinking about it. I want to just punch his head. I tried breathing, kicking rocks. I don't like this feeling. When then I hurt somebody. It's okay to get mad at people. You can't help that. But those thoughts have to stay in your head, okay? Don't act on them. Ever. Did, okay. Is that the right thing to say? I'm strong. I can control what I but do. But yeah, you can control what but you not do. Not what I think. Yeah. Like, I think... I think I'm mad at Tin, too. Running out of cover when Lily attacked the school was really stupid. But he just doesn't know stuff like we do. Right. And then Willie started yelling at him instead of helping him learn. Right. Why don't the other kids know all the stuff we know? When yeah, there's what? a plan, you have to follow it. And when you yell at someone, it just makes them not listen. Well, why don't we teach them? They're smart. Someone just has to show them what to do. Yeah. I want Tim to know how to be safe. We can show them how to be smart, like us. <laughs> it's weird that people are so different. <laughs> it is Erickson's boarding school for troubled youth. Troubled youth? Troubled like bad? No. So they do bad things? Why? <sighs> okay, um, sometimes they do them because bad things happen to them. I knew a doctor once. Do you hear an echo? Let me know. He called it trauma. You have some too, you know. The thing where people can't walk up behind you. I don't like my trauma. I want to get it off of me. How do I get rid of it? I don't even like the way the word sounds. It's really, really hard to do by yourself. A lot of people can't without some help. Like from a doctor? Sure. But those are rare these days. Mm -hmm. or, or, Life or lessons, like school, huh? Right? It was supposed to help with people's trauma. Yeah, it was. And now they help each other. I still like them. I like Tim the most, I think. Even if he does dumb things. Actually, I think he's my first real friend. Oh, yeah? I thought I was your first real friend. Well, yeah, but you don't count. You're old. I am not. Fine. He's my second first real friend. That good old, we haven't seen zombies in like 30 minutes. Let's make some appear. I don't see James, just monsters. James? You're hurt. Did the Raiders do this? It looked like they had people from your school. Why are you here? Those people you saw, we're going to save them. But to do that, we need your help moving some walkers. I could maybe help, but my mask is still in the camp, inside my bag. I can't pass through a herd without it. Okay, then let's go get it. Please, I just, I just ask that you don't kill them. The walkers. Again? If you distract them, I can sneak over and find my mask. Distract all of them? <laughs> exactly. Please. He's Walla. I'll, I'll try. Who said all of them? Oh, good. I feel wrong because this one's way too close to. Dang, this is the one. 
I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. James, where are you at? Yo, James! Yo, James! Now how long I can keep this up? Did you find your mask? I can't find it. The horses must have... There! Oh, shit. We have to run. Hey! Over here! Hey, James! Too many of them. Cart, if we push it, the noise will draw them away. Come on, super say I didn't clip. Oh shoot! No. I didn't even... I didn't even... Oh, freak. You didn't even try to spare them. I can't believe this. I can't believe... I'm about to redo it. I didn't even mean to push that button. I didn't even push that button on purpose. I, my hand slipped. That doesn't even count. My hand slipped. I'm gonna have to do some good editing when I put this on YouTube. Like, I'm gonna leave in my no, and then I'm gonna just be like, whoop, whoop, then <laughs> and then stun her. Dang. I just in two buttons, and my hand pushed one. This name's Wallen. Yo, they got a checkpoint right here because they know. They know people was gonna accidentally do that, yo. Thank you, Telltale, because y'all was, y'all was really wildin' for no reason. been easier to kill them. You're kind. I appreciate it. Really. Thank you for helping me get this back. It was a whole trophy, right? Now, how will Walker save your friends? They're being held captive on a boat not too far from here. We can't sneak on board without cover. Not without the raiders gunning us <clears> down. <throat> He's like, you're a wildin'. To sneak on board their ship? That's insane. It's our only chance. I... I have something I need you to see. So you can understand what you're asking. James. We still need his help, right? Yeah, we do. They just like clamp. <laughs> I don't know about this dude. Oh, 
why is this place kid? Where am I? <gasps> Flashbacks. Oh, what's this? Oh snap. Salt Lake. Why would they do that? Who did this? Salt Skybound Lake. or Telltale? Gross. Well, maybe it's actually good, like chips. Those are salty, right? Like the snack bag in the car. Go ahead, click it if you want to. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, gross. It tastes nasty. <laughs> well, now you know. But don't go eating no mushrooms. But I hope you know that. Don't go around eating mushrooms. Another trophy? I appreciate Skybound for their generosity in the trophies this time around. My people, my former people, they had a practice. They called it collecting. them as a weapon I do this to protect them I know it sounds strange but that's why I brought you here to see them as I do as people as people well not people exactly but <sighs> something in between part of us is still in there deep down so few of us die anymore. We turn. Not dead, not alive. Well, you can't prove that, James. Look, I've heard some weird things, but Walker's soul? Like I said, I know how it sounds. Do you really think there's people inside of monsters? Somewhere, yes. Think about it this way. Has someone you cared about turned? Clemson. Um. Lee. She shot him before he did. So he wouldn't have to suffer. Sorry. Maybe this wasn't the best way to explain. Didn't mean to bring up difficult memories. I lived among walkers for years. Still do, in a way. When they're alone, they're harmless, innocent. If you want my help, I need you to try and walk with them. Oh. Then tell me if you really believe they're just monsters. They are just monsters. They're not people or friends. Clem. She'll be safe, I promise. This isn't smart. It's too dangerous. Edge <laughs> is like, do. yo, chill. <laughs> I'll be fine, AJ. I'm doing this, okay? I. <sighs> okay, fine. Edge is like, yo, Clem. Yo, Clem, chill. Yo, Clem. Chill. The first rule is never go alone. I'm not leaving you. I'll be right back. Check the windows. I will. Don't let fear take over. I will. I promise. Dude, so I check the windows. The mask will disguise your scent. But be gentle. And be quiet. Touch the wind chime. You'll see.
Something about her actions. Or the walkers she killed. Fine. See? No bites. No bites. So, do you still think they're just monsters? Now that you've seen them at peace, any different at all? I... I think you might be right about there being something more to them. It was kind of nice in there. Really? Never met someone who understood. It's. Thank you. I'm glad. What? Have you ever killed a walker before? I have. Many. Have you ever killed a person? Many. Oh. But that was a long time ago. I've killed someone before, too. AJ. You've killed someone? Yeah. I'm a murderer. But I'm trying to atone. Well, that's good. I guess. <sighs> that's enough. What about the walkers? Are you going to help us save our friends? I thought I could, but I can't. So many walkers would die. There's well, the millions death of walkers. I'm sorry, Clementine. But I can't have more blood on my hands. James, the walker in the barn, the one with the different eyes, what was his name? His name? What do you... <laughs> How about the woman in the back, Rose? What's her name? I, I don't know. Asim. Omar. Lewis. Those are the names of my friends, the ones who were stolen by the raiders. I'll never forget that. I may be stubborn, but I'm not heartless. What is that supposed to mean? Those raiders are cruel. They force others to be the same. And if your friends are anything like you, I don't doubt they're worth saving. It'll take some time to guide them through the forest to the shore. Others will join the herd as they go. Tomorrow night, be ready. I can't undo this. Steps. When you said there might be people inside walkers, did you mean it? 
Is he right? Well, we can't know for sure. Maybe he's right. Death might not be like we thought before the world turned like this. Maybe something is left after we die. Dun dun. Dun dun. Weird. But if you believe it, I do too. Come on, AJ. Let's get back before it's too dark. Yo, this is gonna be completely unrelated real quick. But I brought son on eBay and it was like the last one. And I messaged the dude like, yo, can you add more? And he just added more. So I'm about to buy these real quick. I've never met anyone like James. Even though I'm broke. Like I know YouTube okay. money. He's no tough. Twitch money. Not no like real either. money. No They're government money. Monsters, no money money. He's not scared of him either. He's cool. Hey, Clem. Willie told me the plan. How'd things go with that guy? James, he agreed to help us. If somebody told me we were gonna sneak onto a boat and a herd of walkers, I'd have called them crazy. What are you doing with those? Oh, well, <laughs> I wanted to throw one last hoot nanny before the big fight. Swear? Huh? It sounds like a swear. <clears throat> no, it's just another word for party. Right. I know it sounds strange, throwing a party, but people need something to lift their spirits right about now. This could be her last chance. Mm. I wanted to make some tea for everyone. Could I borrow your little heater thing? What can uh, I do? Heater we thing. need to pretty up the old music room. Could you make us something colorful to hang up? Okay, I'll be an artist. Dude may just put up one listing of each. That's fine though, just for me. I'm gonna make the deck, uh, the decor. I'm not gonna lie, it's more expensive, but a decoration better than never party. having it again. Okay, I'll get the heater. But back to this party, let's get the heater. What if I don't even have collectibles? Oh snap! Don't don't do that yet. I'm done, Clint. Come see. No okay, wait. Be right there. Was there collectibles running around? Did I miss something? I don't even think I got collectibles. Hey, you're getting better at this. Hey. Soon you'll be as good an artist as Ten. I don't know. He's really good. Something wrong? AJ? I was just thinking about stuff while I was drawing. What stuff, kid? There are three kind of eyes, Clem. Hmm. Oh, yeah? There are live people eyes. We got those. Then there's monsters eyes. They usually look like dirty water. Other times, monsters eyes aren't even wet. And then there are live people eyes right as you kill them. Like you did to Abel. His, his eyes look like you blew a candle out. He was a bad guy. I know I shouldn't feel like this. I hated him too. And I think there's something wrong with me. You know what, AJ? Everything you're feeling is okay. It makes you a good person. Am I good? I want to be better, Clem. I want people to know I'm good just by my face. And you're the best, okay? I'm getting real smart. <laughs> is that right? Random, okay. Yes. Because I'm always thinking all the time. Okay, what are you thinking about right now? You getting bit, turning into a monster. Oh, yeah. The older I get, the more I see it. I oh why. God, Skybound, please stop. Anyone can get bit. Doesn't matter if you're inside or 
outside or how careful you are. <laughs> That's funny. Well, first, it would suck, like, big time. And then, I'd have to nom nom eat you, little boy. <laughs> Stop! <laughs> oh, man. AJ, I need to know you remember what we talked about. What you're supposed to do if it happens. Listen to me. If I get bit, you'll... Damn. Shoot. No. No, I'm not gonna do that. AJ, you promised. I don't care. I'm not gonna shoot you. If you get bit, I'd want you to bite me too. What? what? Huh? You don't mean that. I wanna be alone. Please don't be mad. I can't live with you not with me, Clem. I know we've talked about it so much, but... I want to say that, but... Don't make me. Alvin Jr., you know you're not supposed to talk like this. You're too strong and too brave. I don't think I am anymore about this. Yes, you are. You are, okay? <sighs> You can't break promises, AJ. I know. You're not letting this go, are you? James said... <sighs> Guess not. That we could be around when we're monsters. Like on the inside. If you got bit, and then bit me, then maybe we'd still be together. Oh. Um... We'd just be a different together. In a way. We might even be okay. You think so? Someone's going Let's to say James might be right. That monsters have part of the person they were still inside them. The thing is, no one can prove that. And if we can't prove it, we're not going to risk our lives over it. Can I go patrol for a bit? Before the party? Sure, go ahead. Be careful. You just want to walk around a cage for like 20 years. Someone's going to clap us. What's with it? You want to be like that couple in episode this one. Needs some space. Can we talk about what happened today? With Minnie? Yeah, sure. What's wrong? The thing is, seeing Minnie, I feel like it should have scared me, but it didn't. The person we ran into in the woods, that wasn't Minnie. Not really. The way she sounded and acted. The way she talked about Sophie and Lily. <laughs> I'm, I'm confused, I guess. It's not Minnie's fault. The Raiders just got in her head. I never said it was, but it doesn't change anything. Minnie, the real Minnie, she's gone. She's been gone this whole time and I have to stop mourning her. I won't let her take you or AJ or anyone else I care mm, about. Powerful. Lewis knows when to keep his head down. Yeah, shit. Oh, I, I, I hope so. You know, when I first got here, I hated him. He was so much. You know, he walks into a room and it's like, look at me, watch me perform. It's so stupid. But uh, then I realized under all that, he, he really cares about people. And he doesn't just feel it. He says it. He'll tell you every goddamn day how much you mean to him. Shit, he'll probably sing about it. Especially if there's already a famous song with your name in it. We've got to get him back. We will. Louis Omar Assem. We'll get them all back. Um, I made you this. Um, what is that? Stars. So you never forget that night. I never will. Oh boy. What's about to happen? Oh boy. When you told me you had feelings for me, I was shocked. Then I started thinking. 
Oh, There's boy. something I've always wanted to try with some of my cured Oh, snap. Like that I never have. What is it? Have you ever danced with anyone before? No. no. Do you wanna? Do. Just us. No one else around. I mean, I know it's kind of weird, but it's something I've always wanted to try. I don't know how to dance. Will you show me? Sure. We'll make it up as we go. AJ is about to walk in like. Oh, <laughs> oh man. I mean, I guess it works. But if I keep this up, she's not gonna get a kiss to episode 4. Thanks for the dance. Unless on episode yeah. 4 she's like, better at being You're ready. not even kissing me! Yeah. find a beach ball it was in some garbage behind one of the dorms I had to blow it up and, and that was pretty gross but look it works <laughs> I should get going Ruby could probably use some help it's cool right super cool <laughs> Back. fast ouch <laughs> <laughs> they got the classic walking dead music playing let me turn turn this up real quick hey they ball play you stopped you're yeah, supposed to be basketball stars I love you Clem I love you back kiddo <laughs> they don't want you to dub <laughs> ready to go Sounds like they need us in the music room. Okay. They say I'm not even gonna give you the chance to dub AJ's love. What kind of sickle? Looks like things are coming together. Yeah. We still need to figure out lighting, music, and something to write on that banner. And they're gonna make me die. pick. Have some fun first. <sighs> they're gonna make me pick all that. But Lewis isn't here. See that? <laughs> it's like Lewis. Wouldn't be a party without some kind of mood lighting. I like that purple one. Going back and forth Good, that is purple. For ages. Green's calming, but purple might be nice. Red gets natural moonlight, so something to compliment that maybe. Purple. Hmm. Well, purple it was. was my favorite color. We're learning Red's more about you, Clem. Color of royalty. Purple. <laughs> really? What? I like purple. Shouldn't you like it too, Violet? <laughs> I'll make it happen. No, so I don't want it. Black things that look like plates, and you put it on here. And then it plays music? Uh-huh. And now you just have to turn that crank on the side. Oh, huh, that's really cool. Pulled out the old headmaster's gramophone so he could play some records. Not much of a selection, but it should do. Just tell me what you want to listen to. Wouldn't happen to have any good jazz records, would you? Oh, yeah. The old music teacher was a big fan. Pretty cool guy up until he ditched us all. What's jazz sound like? Uh, that one's hard to describe. Mm, just wait till you hear it. Are we using the banner for some kind of party theme? Mm, not exactly. It's meant to be more motivational. I'd keep it short, though. There's not as much room as you think. I was thinking something uplifting like, we're gonna get through this. 
Just let me ask AJ, but just I want to say we're getting them back. Still some confidence, you know. AJ, why don't you come up with something? Really? I have an idea. It'll be a surprise. Okay, we'll have Ten break out his paintbrush and ride it out. This place is gonna look great. Oh, and Willie was asking for you. He's up in Marlin's office. He said he had a surprise for the party, but he wanted to show it to you first. Does he? Hey, Clem, check it out. I found a bunch of books on ships. There's some awesome stuff about fires at sea and explosions and stuff. The key is the boiler. Wait, what are you talking about? I have an idea about how to stop those assholes coming back to the school after we've rescued the others. And from hurting anyone else ever again. Oh. We're gonna blow up the boat. It's the only way to make sure they don't come back. Besides, it feels right, you know? For Mitch. Uh, is it me, or is there a bit of a bomb obsession at this school? Oh, it's not you. It totally is. But for good reason! The tricky bit is timing the explosion so that it happens after you get off the boat. Trust me, this will work. We'll be okay. Okay, everybody, get ready to boogie. And, um, Clem, I'm sorry for before about how he treated Ten. I didn't mean to get so angry. I know it's not his fault. That's nice, Willie, but don't tell me. Tell Ten. <laughs> tell him. Mm, tell him. Tell that man. Oh, it's lit. Oh, man. This ain't Persona 5 dancing all night. Ruby, couldn't have done it without you. But just wait till you see what else I've got planned. Go ahead and mingle. I'll let you know when it's time. I guess I'll mingle. I see you two are working together. Yeah, Willie asked me to help with his special project. Well, that's good to hear. Is it ready? Good to go, Clem. It'll work. Actually, uh, I was thinking maybe we should name it. Something cool. I mean, I think it deserves a name. Yeah, we absolutely have to name it. I thought you'd make fun of me, but hell yeah. Let's name this fucker. Yeah. How about Mitch's masterpiece? Yeah, I like that. Mitch would have too. Okay. <laughs> Why are you listening from across the room? You tell me to make her to listen in on my conversations? <laughs> I found them. Okay, Clementine. These here are our official Ericsson psych evaluations and probationary reports. Okay. I don't get it. Well, these explain why all of us got sent to this school in the first place. And all the bad shit we did that kept them from sending us back home. So, what's the game? I figured if we're all going on this crazy mission together, we might as well know who we really are. So, I'll read some of what the adults thought about us. And you have to guess which one of us fits the bill. Oh. I'll make sure it's someone you've actually met. This will be the first one. While otherwise a remarkable student, blank continues to be plagued by fits of anger, uncontrollable cursing, and repeated physical altercations with the senior faculty. Uh -huh. What the heck? Uh -huh. Well, not to speak ill of the dead, but that sounds exactly like Marlin. 
You'd think so, but nope. Really? The person in the file? <laughs> Imagine Marlin times another Marlin. That's Ruby's file! <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit, really? Guilty as charged. Of all the people? Yeah, you should have seen Ruby back in the early days. She was like, uh... You ever seen those Tasmanian devil cartoons when you were a kid? <laughs> that was our Ruby. He used to have a mean streak a mile long. <laughs> Don't worry. That was a long time ago. I mean, I can totally see it. <laughs> the first time I met Ruby, she was all... That little motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> I said I was sorry. You guys want to know why I got sent here? Willie, please, no. Honic masturbation. What the heck? Trust me. Nobody wanted to know that. What does that mean? Ah, uh -uh, don't you dare. <laughs> uh, anyway, he's like, change up the this music? dude touched his no no well, spots. Kind of different music, I think there's a lot of them. Sure, we've heard enough of this. Put on the classical stuff. Dude said, I claim he touches his no no spot. <laughs> Yo. I didn't realize how many of us we'd lost. Remember that Justin guy? And Theresa and Jasper, that one girl with colored braces. And Joey, Maddie, Lamar. Aaron. Yeah, I used to make fun of her braces. Why did I do that? Alex, Dewey, Trey, Stephanie. Holy crap, how many of us died? 34. Damn. Whose is it? Lewis. Should we read it? I could tell you why I was sent here instead. You know, as a consolation prize or whatever. No, I don't know. Hate me after, but since we're all being so open and all. I was hoping you'd tell me. I spent a lot of time at my grandma's house growing up. Well, with my dad being a drunk and my mom working three jobs. But after my grandpa died, grandma just kind of shut down. Spent all day and night rocking in her little chair and then. I'd sit there at her feet as we both watched TV. Mostly cartoons since she never seemed to care. Sometimes I could hear her crying, but I didn't look back. I'd just feel really weird and turn up the volume. You know? Anyway, one day she left the den and came back with another chair and a 22 rifle. Set the rifle butt on the top of the chair, holding the barrel back to her chest. So, you know, she had trouble reaching the trigger this way, but she must have known it would happen because she took out this really tacky wooden back scratcher. The real long kind with the one end shaped like a hand. And, uh, use that to push the trigger in. So yeah, bang, right? And her body folded up and just kept rocking. My mom came to get me five hours later. I hadn't moved. She asked why I didn't call the police or an ambulance or anything. I just shrugged and told her it wasn't like grandma was going anywhere. And besides, I just wanted to finish my cartoons. Damn. She shipped me off to Erickson the next day. I was 11. I'm so sorry, Violet. I can't imagine what that was like, what you went through. It's fine. You've just been 
been through a lot of shit. We weren't good people, Clementine. But it still doesn't mean that we should have been left here to die by the people that were supposed to take care of us. Sorry. This is supposed to be fun. I'm... I'm just not the game type, like Lewis was, I guess. You mean is. We'll see him soon. Ten's right. Hey, I've got an idea. Do you guys remember when Minnie would sing us Don't Be Afraid when all of us used to get scared? Too bad I can't play it. We would have known her. He liked that one. You could just sing it to us, like she used to. Your voice is really pretty. Okay. Okay. Violet yeah. just taking a floor. Right, I, uh, I can do that. Lily just killed it. No one could say anything. It was her moment. Snap. Hey, sweet pea. Oh, snap. So clean. Extra cute. Ooh, Lee looking extra fresh. Oh. Why the train? Always pick the train. Extra fresh. I'm not sure. Maybe because this is where it all started. Where you taught me to shoot and to cut my hair, to be ready for what was coming. Uh, you were a quick study. So, what's on your mind this time? I'm worried, Lee. I've got a lot of people depending on me, and I don't know if what I'm doing is right. All right. It's mad fresh. Oh, I know that feeling. You know, I was uh, making it all up as I went along, right? <laughs> Couldn't let on, of course. 
You being so little. I kinda had to think on your feet. Monsters took over the world, and you got stuck taking care of an eight-year-old girl. You were a handful, but I didn't get stuck with anything. You kept me going. You want to tell me about what you're up against? I'm with a new group now, and I've been in so many, and they always fall apart. I really like this one. It's different. It almost feels like home. That's a good thing. It's hard being alone out there. But we're in trouble. Some bad people captured my friends. And getting them back might get the rest of us killed. I'm not worried. What? Whatever trouble you're in, you get out of it. You get your friends out of it. You don't know that. I know you're a survivor. That ass. Clementine, I know is gonna fix it. I really believe that. Yeah, I made it this far, didn't I? You sure did, when a lot of other people couldn't. But still. Never give in, Clem. That's like saying the Clem would survive. How do you know about Lewis? Those boys are gonna have hope again, knowing that you came to rescue him. <sighs> oh, sweet pea, you know you always get like this before something big. <laughs> Remember how scared you were before you charged into that mess at McCarroll Ranch? You survived that, didn't you? That was different. I was alone. Yeah, like now she got people to depend on. Right, lose. right. But having people you care about, that's a good thing. Friends, a girl who loves you. Mm. They're fighting beside you because of you. Who's who's using his dialogue? They know what Go they're to saying. You again when you've gotten them out, okay? Out and safe. Sound good? And hopefully we can talk about happier things. If you know of any. Lee, I miss you so much. I wish you were really here. I miss you too, Clementine. But we'll have to make do with pretending. Damn. Thank you, Lee. Talking to you always makes me feel a little bit better. I meant to ask, how's the boy? He's good, Lee. You'd like him. I bet. You teach him to shoot yet? <laughs> you have no idea. <laughs> I guess the world got pretty hard since I left it. Kid growing up in it. He'd be hard too. You're in my shoes now, raising a kid. Think you got a handle on it? Uh, it can't be easy. Wanting to give him a childhood, but knowing what it takes to survive now. It was easier for me since the world was just changing. But you're living in one that's changed completely. I really don't know. The world AJ was born into is off. It's really awful now, Lee. And I just don't know if I'm teaching him right. I can't think of anyone who could do it better. Mm hmm. Imagine if you teach AJ the wrong things and Lee is like, You're not teaching him right. You're trash, Clem. <laughs> huh. Short. 
Um, you don't know how hard it is to find scissors these days. <laughs> Time to go, Clementine. You've got people that need you. All right, Lee, it's been real. Goodbye, Lee. We all need that. Clint, wake up. It's time to go. Damn, already? We're really doing this. Only the team blending in with the walkers need to cover themselves. Now we just need your walker friend. He's here. Good lord. Uh, hello. Guys, this is James. He's my friend. He's, uh, <laughs> cool. How do you get the skin like that? Uh, oh. I, um, Clementine? Can I try it on? That's not a good idea. Come on, please. Oh, come on, give him some space. But I just want to... Not right now. Yeah, right. Sorry. I didn't mean to be weird or anything. It's okay. Oh, and sorry I tried to shoot you that one time. Your mask looks so real. It I, does. Uh, hey. Hey there, James. Sorry about Willie. Is this the guy that Clem said she'd marry? Oh. <laughs> yeah. Oh, Clementine. Can I speak to you alone for a moment? Good idea. Hold tight. Hey, Tank, can you come talk for a sec? There's something I have to tell you. The walkers. They'll be here in a little while. You can join them as they pass through the trees. The noise from the boat will draw them toward the water. Then we can get on board and save our friends. Your friends are... different. Open-minded. Accepting. Like you. That's not usually how my first impressions go. Sorry, I feel like I'm rambling. It's just being welcomed. It's strange. You know, they could be your friends too. I know you didn't want to come into the school before, but now that you've met them... I haven't lived with people in a long time. But it does sound nice. Let me think about it. Yeah, don't just take it off. Make sure that noise. I wanted to show you something. You always trying to show me something like what's really good. This is was my boyfriend. Oh Charlie. snap! We joined the whispers together, but it changed him in a way that couldn't be undone. It changed both of us. What do you mean? The whispers. Or my family from a young age. I'm about the black. Time, I witnessed a lot of death and suffering. Now because of his story. Of it. Weakness was considered a poison. And I believed in that fiercely. So much so 
that when another boy expressed sympathy for our enemy before an attack, I slit his throat. What the heck? I didn't talk to him. I didn't consider who he was, what he felt. <laughs> Honestly, I don't even remember his name. All I knew was someone like him would only slow us down. That's... that's kind of hard to believe. Doesn't sound anything like you. Not anymore. But it was. I had no doubt in my mind that I was right. After he died, I kept hearing his words in my head. Those people are like us. Just on a different path. I stopped killing after that. I changed. No one else did. When AJ told me he killed someone, it reminded me of them. Of myself. He said it was wrong. But it sounded like he was just repeating what he'd been told. Taking life like that, from a young age, it breaks something inside you. It broke something in Charlie. I just... I'm afraid if AJ kills again, he won't be able to go back. He won't be the same boy he was. I've seen it happen too many times. I'm not going to let AJ become a killer. I don't want him to change. Not like that. I hope you can keep that promise. Damn, this and AJ just might be a savage savage. If you keep clapping people. That's kinda, you know, a little scary. I'll lead you through the herd until you reach the boat. That's as far as I go. After that, it's up to you. Thank you. Take care of AJ. Okay, he's ready to go. The walkers are getting close. Ruby, you're in charge of the horses. Willie, Ted, take care of the supplies. I've got the bomb. Find the boiler. There'll be a door on the bottom with ash and stuff. Put it in there. I'll cut it open. I don't even know what the banner said. Violet told me about Minnie. That Sophie died and Minnie is one of them now. Just... If you see her out there, tell her... Tell her I forgive her. Please. I tell her myself, but I just want her to be okay. Yeah, sure. If we see her, I'll let her know. Thanks. Yeah. So it's so deep. We gotta move. Clem? What happens if someone else gets caught while we're in there? What if it's you? I couldn't save Minnie or Lou or the Sim. Omar. I... I, I really care about you, Clem. If something happened to you because of me, I can't lose you too. No one is losing anybody. That's not going to happen, Violet. I'm not going anywhere. I promise. I know that's easy to say, but look, I've got your back. Okay? That's all. Are we good? Yeah. I think so. Okay, let's bring our friends back home. All of them. All of them. It's ready. So, I know this is gonna sound gross, but... Covering your smell. <laughs> Smart.
Does it smell on this ship? I think it does smell. Oh my god, walkers! Thanks. You're just like she gonna do that herself. We're doing it. Let's get it. Mission Impossible. Follow my lead. Here we go. Oh, damn, here we go again. Oh shoot. Stay behind the walkers. Use them as shields. Okay, they're gonna shine the light on them. Shine, shine the light on them. That's not letting me run. Oh shoot! Shine the light on them. I'm about to clip her. Oh snap! Oh, I'm about to die. Oh, I'm about. To I guess you can't go too far ahead. I guess. I guess. Um, this mad zombies. So I just gotta chill behind some real quick. Don't go up ahead. Oh, shit, get him. I'm just stay right here. Right here. Dun -dun 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 Damn, I'm gonna take a step back, hide behind this dude real quick. But now I'm in the front. Now I'm in the front, yo. Oh, now I'm in the front. Yo, what are zombies? Yo, yo, he's looking at me. Yo, he's looking at me. Yo, what are y'all two doing? Yo. This big chubba lubba. <laughs> big chubba lubba. Okay, now's our chance. We can't risk leaving cover. We'll have to crawl along the side of the dock. Do look like the dude from Mafia 3. Ready to clip somebody. Under the water? Oh shoot, they under the sea. Under the sea. The guts is gone. The walk is down. Now I swear, under the sea. <laughs> Yo. Oh, get off me, kid. Triangle your face. Under the sea, the waters don't know us. The gods have washed us. We're under the sea. Come 
on, let's hurry. Ready, AJ? Walkers. Now we got Clapham. Okay, we can't just hurry up. Yo, wait. Water getting crazy. Oh, they water getting crazy. I'm scared. Clap them. Clap them. Clap them. Clap them. Clap them. No. Clap them. Clem. Come on. Let's hurry. Ready, AJ? Walkers. This this army right here ain't playing like You better put on your your best Fortnite aim because yo, they're not playing. Did they open the door? How do they do that? Oh, I got I just got two trophies. Let's get it. Yeah. No, 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 We're getting close. After we find the boiler and place the bomb, we'll get our friends out. Many said they keep prisoners on the second deck. Look out for guards and stay quiet, okay? Right behind you. Good. I'll scout ahead and signal when it's clear. Got it? You sound like Call of Duty. RPG! I'm being electrocuted. Seraph incoming! A ruin on the way. You know what it needs to sound like? Destiny 2. Guardian. Guardian impel. They about to have a guardian down. How's that supposed to mean? I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna kill the dude, but. Hey, Glenn, this has gotta be the boiler, right? Yeah, it looks like it. That's where we need to plant the bomb. There's too much stuff in the way. Maybe there's another way in. I'm not gonna kill the dude, but I'll plant the bomb so he blows up. Give this dude a whole concussion. Damn, move! Yeah, I heard my analog stick. Like, I know you heard my analog stick. Wait here. I'm to give this dude a concussion too, Clem. the whole bow double wielding like bang. she do wielded the bow which is masterpiece but how do we know when it's gonna blow go. up which is masterpiece bury this thing in the bottom of the river once they start up this boat we won't have much time before it explodes how long? Not sure. An hour, 30 minutes. Let's hurry up then. 
Mm -mm -mm. It shouldn't take us 30 minutes. This, this is a little 15 minute quick in and out operation. Alright, is this the first floor or. Minerva, focus. Mm. I have a little brother, just a short, scarred face. See, he's not out there, is he? Look, we've discussed this. Your family is Delta now. There ain't no room for anyone. Yo, else. smack this girl. Yes, ma'am. Shit. Of course, she had to be the cell guard. We can't sneak past her. Damn. Of course, right? Oh, triple team. You got him caught up in this. Just, just tell me that he's safe. Give me that. He told me to tell you. He forgives you. Shit. I'll help you get everyone out. Then you take my brother and run. Get him back to where it's safe. Come on, we have to hurry. Mm, this is OD, Clem. We told you you had oh it God, in the bag. Oh my God, are you okay? Doesn't look hurt. I, uh, yeah, I'm all right. We're all right. Take care of Louis first. He's, he's in rough shape. What? I'll unlock the other cell. How does that mean? What do I do? We don't have a lot of time before Doreen comes back. Violet, help me with these guys. Got what? it. What, the, what did it do? Lewis. Lewis. What the hell? What the fuck are you doing? Please. Don't no. fucking point at that. Come in, Violet. Don't have me. Yo, what's going on? She gave me a concussion like I gave the other dudes? What the hell happened to you? Lewis. It's a wrap. Now it's a wrap. Now it's a wrap. We're not staying here that long. Now it's a wrap. That's a trophy. What is wrong with y'all? Now y'all got me tight. Now y'all done it. Looks like there's a gap here. Now I'm not playing games. I'm too small to fit my hand through. Yo, yo, what's good, Velvet? What happened? Clem, are you all right? No. I'm fine. Where's AJ? Over here. Thank God. Shit. At least we're not moving yet. 
We've still got time to figure this out. They dead ass violated right. and I'm not with I'm it. Fine. Looking for a way out. If this thing explodes. But dead dead. You doing okay in there, AJ? Yeah. I'm alright. I'm looking for a way out. Yeah, me too. The doors don't look very well made. Maybe that's something we can work with. Kick this shit down, like I'm not playing. How you holding up? I can't talk. If Lily She told us not to talk. We'll be home soon. Just hang in there. Oh my Yo, God. that's crazy. I just want to go home. She's gonna have niggas. She gonna okay. have people out there without tongues fighting for her. She think that's gonna work. This is retarded. Lily went too far. Be able to chip away at this if I She's to worse her. than the last dude. The last Damn, dude just killed people. This dude, this girl is just wallin'. Do you still have your knife? Yeah, they didn't find it. Only the big one. Good. I need you to slide it over to me. <sighs> they, they went way too far. What would they have done to Violet? She don't talk that much. This dude can never sing again. This dude's just gonna be sitting around playing piano. Last resort. Hold up. I'll get us out of here. I promise. This dude is done done. He can never talk again. Can I, let me try talking without my tongue real quick. I could talk, kinda. We'll see how how this goes on the next app, cause they're really violent, and I'm not gonna stand for this. Whatever you do, don't. I promise you, it ain't worth it. Step back. Shut your black. Yes, ma'am. Raggedy. Oh, I got more head than you. I'll take it from here. Yo, come close, please. I'm gonna stab you in your neck. You don't, yo, stab her in the neck. Yo, Minnie. Yo, Minnie, smack Where's her in the head? back of the head. He's dead. We killed him. We put a knife in his head. Damn, savage. Fuck, you little monster. Damn it. We showed him mercy. He was terrified of turning, so we stopped him from having to. We gave him what he wanted. <laughs> I'm sure you did. You know, we're not like you, you ugly, psychopathic. Oh, I can't even think of stuff to say to you. Ugly, miniature, psychopathic. Oh, no, she's not even mini. Open the door. Yes, ma'am. There's just some ugly... Tall, raggedy, curbside Normally, trash. Paused, I'd shoot you and toss you overboard. But I'm genuinely impressed. First, you organized these idiot kids into a fighting force and kill two of my most experienced soldiers. We didn't soldiers. even kill them. Then you sneak onto my boat under the cover of a herd. I bring a prize like you back to the Delta. It might make this whole clusterfuck of a mission worth it. Someone like you, so young with so much potential, you're far too valuable to kill. Look, if I'm the one you want, let the others go. This isn't a negotiation. 
This is me telling you how things are going to be. You know, my father, Larry, was a Yo, fuck Larry. And when I was a kid, he had all kinds of rules. The thing that bugged him most was waste. If I ever left a light on after leaving a room, he'd flip. No matter how many times he ranted about the cost of electricity, I could never remember to hit that switch. Okay. So, so one day, he let our power get cut. He liked illustrations to show that actions have consequences. No more TV, no more hair dryer, no more ice cream sandwiches. Just a miserable family sitting in the dark. Well, I guess asshole runs in the family. Is that the consequence? That you're an asshole? Facts. The consequence is, I never left the lights on again. My father had his thoughts, Shut up. But he showed me I don't care. teaching by example. Whatever. Is that what this is? A lesson? Yo, get that gun out of my face before I disrespect both of y'all right here. It's not even a gun. Fake ass Daryl. Dang, this sounds like a demonetization. I want to tell you a story. Let's call it the parable of the twins. Two girls were taken from their home and brought to a new place to live. They had to leave their friends and family behind and that was hard at first. They shed a lot of tears. But the new place was a good place. The people there grew corn and raised pigs and the twins ate well for the first time in years. They had hot showers, clean clothes, beds. They were given guns and trained to use them. The people there were kind to these girls. All that was asked in return was that they help defend the group. You see, this place had a lot of enemies, killers and thieves who wanted what they had. They needed help fighting or they'd lose everything they built. Their crops, their power, even their lives. They threatened to cut out their tongues? They only do that to the ones who can't keep their mouths shut. One of the girls saw that this was a place worth fighting for, and her tears dried. Let me guess. This thought. But the other twin, she could never forget her old home. She rejected every gift, every opportunity stirred up trouble every chance she got she convinced her sister to help her steal a rat and leave on the river of course they didn't get far what happened then minerva i killed her what the jesus fuck? christ minnie no tell me it's not true your own sister why would you do that because the Delta is your new family? She was twisting my head with her lies. You're and twisting. I made a mistake. I needed to show my loyalty to the place I call home. Like it or not, you're one of my people now, Clem. The question is, which twin are you going to be? The loyal one or the dead one? What have you done to her head, you... Fucking psychotic bitch! You're evil! You are fucking evil! Y'all better back away from the door. All right, Lily. You made your point. I'll do what you want. What? No! You can't become a soldier in their army. This is tweaking that... Don't hurt anyone else. A crazy Good. turn. I'm surprised to hear you bend so easily. But as I said before, this isn't a negotiation. Huh? Pull the mouthy one out of the cell. Her? They clearly didn't get the moral of the story. What we'll the have to help them understand. What are you doing? Stop! Don't hurt Violet, or I'll hurt you. Oh! You better cool it, or you're gonna get yourself hurt. Fuck no! Get off of me! I didn't kiss Violet. Easy. Bro. Stay still. Shit. What are you doing? Don't make this hurt more than it has to. Fuck. Come on. Just breathe. AJ, no! Fuck, no, no, no! 
That's it. That's it. We'll take that L. Okay. We'll take that. We'll take that. That's nothing. That's nothing. You think you can kill me? I know I can. We'll throw you in the river, and we'll put a knife right to the side of your head. Big talk for a little guy. I know I can do it. I killed Marlon. He wasn't a monster, but you are. Bang. So you killed Marlon. I bet you'd make a great soldier. Fuck. AJ, listen to me. Don't talk to her, okay? She's a monster. Clem seems to care a lot about you. Come on. Let's go have a chat. Just us. <laughs> fucking touch him! Clem! No, no, please! Clem inside! AJ! Keep an eye on her, Minerva. Don't moving. I want to be far away from you. Fuck. Uh, Fudge. Don't you dare look at me like that. This is the only way we survive. Who are you? Fuck survival. Look at what you're doing. Mini. Kill him. Kill him. Grab that. Talk to you for a I'm sorry we never searched for you, for Sophie. I'm sorry we trusted that fucker Marlin. If I ever thought there was a chance, I know, I know, okay? But Sophie's dead. I have a new family. Many Fuck that. People. You chose. You chose. This you chose this. Way. Lay down. Stay in line, or you die. The people you love. Die. Kick the door open, they smack her. What they say you can live. All of you. You can have a nice life. Be rewarded. Just like I am. You gave up, Minerva. I never will. Tell her. Get him. Stab her. Oh, that works too. Oh! 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 I won't let you get them all killed. Kill him. Kill this girl. Minerva! I can't let her leave. Shit. Oh. Take that arrow out of her and stab her with it like four more times. Come on, we have to go. I can't. I can't leave her. Go, I'll catch up. Clem, come on. We have to get the hell out of here. Go. I need to find AJ. Better see you on land. You will. This is gonna end crazy. Clem and AJ is about to get kidnapped. Or, or just AJ, and we gotta get AJ back, or just Clem. I don't know. Yo, this is. Shit, they started the boiler. Yo, it's about to, yo, it's about to blow up, <laughs> and then we escape on some double O seven. Sharpen. I've known Clementine since before this all started. She'll come. Around. Who's that? Mikey You'll Simon. Once you see what we have to offer. Forget what you have to offer. Found one more sneaking over the docks. Ten. Fuck. Tennessee, did you get lost? Ma'am, he wasn't alone. I got something else to show. This way. Move over here, Wallen. 
found this in the herd. <gasps> no wonder there were so many walkers. They know about them. How do you find that? You must have thought you were clever leading those walkers here. You or just find this dude? Nothing to say. You don't fucking scare me. Why is his text pink? Is that is that because they revealed he's your ways onto bi ish? Because you're afraid. Because you're weak. I give my people a cause to fight for. The thing about people like him, AJ, is that they're too broken to fit into a community. They won't fight for anyone but themselves. Oh. Kill it. No! Fuck! Oh! Easy there, Ten. Don't hurt him. Just stop hurting people. Please. Shoot her! Why don't we all just take a breath, all right? Give me my friends back. Put down Yo, the Ten, gun. class. <laughs> Clap. All of us. Or, or else. Fine. Go ahead then. Do it. Save your friend. <gasps> oh, she's wilding. She's wilding. Tim can't do that. Oh, I see. You came here to cry. Tim. Looks like you're not a soldier either. Oh! oh. AJ, get her! This is getting me lit. Hold up. AJ, grab that! AJ, grab that! Oh, did I mess up? Oh, I pushed. Lily ain't playing no more, huh? It's time to get serious, right? It's time to get serious, right? Get up. Oh, damn, she got right up. James been fighting that dude for a good minute. Come on. You're not going to do it? Oh, shoot. Yo, ship explode, get her off balance, clap her. Stab her in the back. Stop. Oh. oh, she don't even care. She don't even care. She don't even. Clem, AJ, where's AJ? AJ! AJ, wait! I give up! I will AJ. give up! Put down the gun! I'll let everyone leave! My crew and I will leave! We won't bother you anymore! Damn, I said AJ ain't gonna clap nobody else. AJ. But it's about that time! She's, She's just about that time! You are down there! You didn't see what she did! It's about that time. It's about that time. Don't you fucking dare, AJ. She'll never replenish anything. It's up to you. Give me the gun. You can't let her hurt anyone. You can't. I don't want to die. Do it, AJ. Yeah. I don't really kill people, but I had to. Oh, let the clip loose. Let the clip loose. Yo, he said it. Bro, shut up, James. I dead don't care. You don't know. Really? We couldn't find the other. We, we don't care. You fucking dead. Yes, blow up. We out. 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 See, yo, if she was alive, she would have escaped right there and came right back, right back to doing her BS. Now she can't do her BS. Now, the only way she can do some, only way this could turn out bad, still not bitten team, heard y'all. The only way this could turn out bad is if her people are worse than her, which should not be the problem. Yo, we good. 
We got. Damn, people killed all of the walkers? Why y'all wallin'? You could stop that. I didn't want AJ to get clapped. What's this? 42%. Yo, you're mad loud in the background talking. Hold up. Refused. Y'all wallin'. Y'all wallin'. She had to die. T 10 MIA. 10 was grateful when you stood for him. Grateful, okay, whatever. Well, M M I A, righteous. Um, yeah, 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 blah 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 blah. Heart sick. He, he was a shirt. Romantic when we dance. Uh huh. Uh huh. Fuck! I want that to happen. I need not. What? Stop. Freaking, I don't care if I'm you're devastated. She had to die. I'm terrified. How are you terrified about my promise? I'm saving your your buns. AJ. It's conflicted. AJ felt there's no way to prove. Because you're rolling. And you. Oh, damn it. He felt powerful. Damn, he felt powerful. I don't want Edge to turn into a psychopathic killer. But she had to die. Where are those? Oh, wait. Rosie is worried. Really is excited. Ruby did not recognize. Was proud. Oh. I guess that is good for her. But okay, like... I ain't find none of my items. Yo, this was a good app. Yo, March 26th? About to be brazy. Do we get a trailer? Do we get something? Do we don't get nothing? Yo, that was crazy. That was some next stuff right there. Alright y'all, March 23rd, 6th, March 26th, it's lit, the menu is going to be blue, yup, what's the picture though, damn it's just a Clem's hat, yo no one knows what's going to happen, but all we know is it's going to just be so crazy, it's just going to be so devastating, they're going to be like, yo I wish we could go back, Back to the way things used to be. It's crazy now. I'm like, whew. Yo, finally had to clap Lily, yo. Yo, that's it. You know, if you came by, thanks for coming by. Hope you enjoyed your stay. If you're watching us on YouTube, thanks for watching. Great episode. And, you know, have a nice day. Have a nice night. And until the next one.